morning. Uh, Here we are in our vlog today. It's eight in the morning and we are going to Lake Forest to uh, meet the girls of the volleyball team of Westcliff University. They came to Clara's event, Keep Dreaming in Irvine, and they invited us to go there and to relate with Clara, uh, maybe do a beauty day in the future. A Saturday we are going to their game. So let's see, this is an example of inclusion, of building relationships, so not just one thing, yeah, we do just one thing and it's okay. I have my clean conscious, clean thoughts that I did something, but it's about building relationships. So they are mostly, why are you laughing? <laughs> because <laughs> the aggressive is inside of uh, when we drive in the rush hour. It doesn't bring anything, it just makes me laugh. What? <laughs> the, the aggressiveness of the drivers in the rush hour is everybody's so in a rush. Okay, I thought it was about me, no, no. my English or something. Okay, so we are going and uh, come with us. afraid that the ball will hit her and it's kind of strong balls oh my, uh. so let's just go now that they are without ball It's relieved because now it's Ma. eating time. Ma. Ma. <laughs> you enjoyed, and now it's eating time. Ice cream. <laughs> they said about ice cream. Ah, you are saying maybe it will have ice cream. Ma. Ah, we need to ask them if they say yes, ice cream. Ma. I need to bring you to ice cream. Mm. Another day. I forgot uh, ev ah, okay. Invite everyone to have an ice cream with you. Okay. But if it's us, uh, make a surprise. We just ask, let's meet, and then we meet everyone for ice cream. Okay. 
So, here we are. Why are we here? <laughs> we are here to have a team meal with Clara and with Greg's friends. Yeah. Just to spend time together and, you know, outside of volleyball so we get to know each other a little better. Do any of you live with each other? We live with each yes, other. Yes, Ava and I, I live together <laughs> about eight minutes away from here. Okay, that's precious. You're the only ones that live together. She lives with another girl that left to go to school. Yeah. Wow. And then she lives with some of the basketball girls. Yeah, basketball and one softball girl in my life. Any issue with keeping the room in order or the, the common spaces? <laughs> Whoa! Whoa. She, doesn't, she doesn't do her laundry. I have an issue. I do my laundry. I just don't put it away immediately. And okay. I also clean the bathroom every day. So it's like even. Clara is longing to tell you what I found a new hack with David. I said, the deal is this. Room is not in shape. I will not do your laundry. But actually, I'm... Uh, um, marshmallow over dead. So I do the laundry, but I hide the laundry until the room is not smart. smart. And I say, then you get it back. So then they're big scenes. Yeah. What do I go naked to school? Or Our to room's it. clean. Yeah. Well, that's a big step ahead, you know, in maturity because often we learn nature. And you're saying. Uh, Clara wants to know if you have two rooms or if we sleep in the same room. I share a room same with my room. roommate. Same. Yeah. That's um, it's fun though. Yeah, it's like a sleepover. <laughs> Students <laughs> in Holland are so lazy with the dishes that they came out with this thing that they've got a, a fork and a spoon hanging on a weight, and it just goes back into the seating. So they put it down on the court. So they just eat like that because they were not washing their cutlery. Isn't that disgusting? <laughs> That's terrible. I want to say that she her has her own room and the leaves own room but sometimes they need to share mm. because if we have people coming over yeah. mm. where's your little brother? Oh. Yeah, he is into... Uh, because Clara goes just uh, on Monday and Thursday, she does not go to school. So when we have events or she needs to paint or, or now because of her surgery, she's doing a lot of physio. So she has three days in school and two days off. Clara, happiness, Panta. Uma. Because we cannot fight now with her and say you should not have Fanta. So she is, um, I don't know the word in English. She's take advantage. Eventually. I just, and I'm about to lose my wife. For that. So we are going to the volleyball game and it's one drama but we are going with Thiago, Grandma, Judy and Clara <laughs> and we have a drama. So we just arrived. Of course Clara is hungry. Today we didn't have lunch. David Carlo is helping Thiago to go out of the car and go to the wheelchair. And here are grandma. Grandma is ready to play. You're wearing it. And Judy is ready to go to the beach. To play. <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, our team lost, and now Clara can eat something—a big thing. 
not big. Cheeseburger. <laughs>